Those in the Hebrew approach, including Exodus explorer Ryan Morrow, have another challenge for the traditional Sinai location, based on the Israelites' travel speed to Mount Sinai. The traditional Mount Sinai candidate makes sense if you believe the Israelites only had to travel a few miles per day, but that doesn't seem to be what the Bible really describes. What you see is a situation where they were going as fast as they possibly could, more than just a few miles a day. They were traveling day and night. That's the whole point behind having a pillar of cloud and a pillar of fire so that they could continuously travel. The Bible seems to make it sound like it's a, a miracle how they didn't stumble and how they were able to just keep going that long distance. 